but fuck it. You know what? Screw it. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna push through. Um, I will eventually figure it out how close is too close. I thought I had it that time. And then I, uh, I don't know, maybe it's a timed event too. Maybe I can't take so long to do it. What is, like, um, if I were to, like, stand here, how far would be, like, two or three feet? Yeah. Probably to about that far. So, like, from here to here? Yeah, or to the end of that, that table, roughly. Oh, that is so okay. close. Okay. Thank you. Um, it's just asking for some advice from the guy who measures everything. Uh, okay, we are, we found the flashlight. We're gonna, I'm so sad, that was such a good run, we were doing so freaking well. And then, like always, frickin the female noir ruins my entire life. Like, she ruins everything every single time. I absolutely hate it. Kind of makes me want to cry. We're gonna let's see. Um, we're gonna do this, and then this one might be the last drown for the night because it's getting it's getting late, and I do gotta make dinner, unfortunately. Press okay. this. Space? Yeah, because if this arrow goes red, that means I'm losing lead. Right now I'm getting my okay. answer down a amount. Okay, I'll try and pay attention. I'll press space if you I start don't losing think money. I will go down because I'm making money, but once I get a milestone, mm -hmm. a big thing will pop up. It auto pauses and leave it. Okay. I will make try and make sure you don't lose any money. I got it. Okay, I will make sure you don't lose any money. Go to the bathroom. Sorry about that. My uh, fiance game's like right beside me. So, you guys will probably hear him talking to me. He was just trying to ask me to pause his uh, game. City Skylight 2, Lines 2, whatever it is. City Skylines 2. City Skylines 2, sorry. That he's been playing since yesterday. He just wants me to pause it in case he starts losing money while he's in the washroom. But, but y'all, yeah. I will still watch for you because if I don't and you lose money, you're gonna come to me and cry. Oh, uh, she'll be fine. I've got enough industrial buildings. I'm making fuck tons of money. Okay. I'm not demanding anything. So. I'll still keep an eye on it for you. I'm probably going to still go to the kid with care. Okay. Go to the bathroom. Sorry about him. He usually just sits there quietly and plays his games, for the most part. Like, I'm sure eventually he can join me in some games, but... We don't really, um, play the same type. Also, he is, um... He's not a fan of horror or scary things. We used to play a uh, Phasma together and he did not like that at all. Like, he was a very big baby in Phasmo. We have a phone right there. Um, I think, like, he would be the one that would be like, I'm going in, we find the ghost, we get out. Whereas the rest of us wanted to do the extras, but... Who knows, I might be able to find a game that he can join in and play. Um, I'm not seeing much. Um... Are you guys like having a good weekend? I mean, week. It's only Tuesday. It's been. I don't know. It's been. The month is going by pretty fast. Like, it's hard to believe that it's almost uh, Halloween already. Like, I swear. I mean, it's hard to believe that it's almost the end of 2023. Feels like it all just started not that long ago. Don't, I'm scared to see how fast everything's gonna just keep going by. I'm excited, but scared. And I have... I will be, uh, most likely moving soon. I don't know when. I'll definitely give everyone updated on the date, because whenever I do move, it's obviously going to be a no-stream day. 
Um, but we will be moving. Uh, we went and checked out a place today. And we'll be going again uh, tomorrow. But I don't know if anyone else is out here who's looking for places to live. Um, especially in, like, Alberta where I am right now. But it is so hard to find a decent apartment for a decent price. Like, we're not even, not even looking for much. Like, I'm okay if there's no laundry and stuff in it, or if there's no dishwasher, even though we just bought a portable one. <laughs> but, like, the prices and the stuff they expect for, like, one bedroom and studios is ridiculous. And it sucks because we're trying for a, um, we need a two bedroom for my step, so my stepson can have his own room when he comes over on the weekends. It's hard. Like, there's so many people looking. It's, like, so competitive. And we're hoping, uh, if we stay with the company that we currently rent from, that we get a better chance of getting an apartment. So, we'll see. I think uh, the one we're going to see tomorrow is probably going to end up being the one we want to get. Uh, from what I've heard, it has a laundry in the suite, luckily, and it has... Um, a backyard and everything for us that we could use so I think I think it'd be a good bet if we like it that we can get it or I hope because I hate I hate moving absolutely hate it I think it's the packing I hate the most to be honest but I think I own I think I own too much and I try and downsize but you run across things from like when you were younger or things that you have memories with and it just you don't want to get rid of it which is unfortunately what happens a lot when i try and downsize all my stuff I find a lot of stuff that i reminds me of my childhood or i have a whole oh we got a wallet right there i have like a whole uh little box full of artwork that my little sister drew me when she was younger i don't want to get rid of that either because She's not little anymore. She's all grown up and I feel like getting rid of something like that would just... Who in the hell is that? She looks like she's going through an existential crisis. Something's going on in her life. We're gonna just peep. But she looks like she's going through some shit. Okay, we're gonna... You're still there. She definitely is going through some shit. But look at that, we've already gotten two. We've already finished it. And we're not even, we haven't even got our first package. And Clint, Clint is still talking to us about things. Like, I don't know. It feels like the events or whatever they're called are just so sporadic. Cause some games like now we have found like three already and it's not even 1030. But then other matches, we don't find anything. Like, we find nothing for the longest time. It's just weird that it's so sp sporadic and there's like so much happening either all at once or there's nothing happening. But that's fine. We don't have anything to worry about now. Uh, we don't have Lucas there. I don't think that that has changed. I think it might change at like 10.30, 10.35-ish. Did I? Oh, sh shit. It did change. Never mind, I'm dumb. Uh, 94479. 94479. Let's hope we can lock it before Lucas finds out it's not locked. Uh, 94479. There we go. Huh. So it changes before 10.30. Good to know. I can probably eventually pinpoint it down to exactly what time it changes. Uh, package? We have a package to room 6C. Uh, package to room 6C. 6C. I'm just gonna quickly check, 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 check 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 mm, nothing the lady have an existential crisis and what the fuck is that ah uh, that that's suspicious dude 
He's just standing inside the window. What are you peeping on? There's no one in here. The lady in her underwear is left. Um, we're gonna go to s get the package for 60, I think. That one. That was a new one. I have not seen that one before. Always check the hallway, left, right, and then elevator. Dude, I have never seen that one before. And then we go to 6C. 6C. Probably keep saying it so I don't forget. Because I'd rather not have to run back down and grab my stuff and run back up. And then it's just such a waste of time. I should have like a little a phone. We should have a cell phone that just tells me all the emails and I can check the emails. I would like that to be able to check the emails on the fly. That would make the game too easy. Thank you. I wonder if they'd ever add it so you can like open the package. I'm curious what they're all what they're getting. It's just like a small envelope, so what I mean, they could be getting like the dongles and stuff we were getting from um Welcome to the Game 2. So we had a lot of deliveries, but just very curious what it is all these people are ordering. Let's go. We'll vibe to the music and we'll go to 6C and deliver the package and then we'll go back to the apartment and probably die to the Lady Noir because she's, she's not nice. Why is there laundry just This is literally the weirdest apartment, co building, complex, whichever, that I've ever... Like, they leave their shoes out here, their laundry... Like, the whole thing at the starting screen you read says we live in a bad part of town. So why would you leave your stuff outside for people to steal? Like, you just leave your, your things out there for them to steal? That is ridiculous. But whatever. <laughs> I think I think too logically in a lot of these games. But I don't know. It's hard to throw out logic or question why pe why things do stupid things. Especially characters in games. Honey? Okay. Let's see if I can remember this. Um, I think it was like 94474? 944s. Seven six. Chip. Okay, let's see what it is. Unless it changed. I'm pretty sure it was nine four four something. Nine four seven nine. It was nine four four seven nine. I was close. Nine four four seven nine. Nine four four seven nine. I was so close. Off by one frickin' digit. Uh, just bathroom check. Okay, Ronald. Ronald, we we can't be doing that. You barely ran. Okay. He's he's still there. He's gone. So pretty good. We have five reports out of two currently, meaning we're gonna be set up with three in the next one, which means we just need. One. Oh, the lady with the existential crisis. I recognize that hair. Um, peep. There's a man looking through your window at you, just so you know. I think, I assume that was your bedroom he was looking at. But look at that. We are now going to be six out of two, which means we have enough completely for, uh, 11 p.m. So anything next will be going towards uh, midnight. Really good. Okay, she's gone now. Um, no, we're going this way, okay. 
Nothing. Oh, there's a gun right there. Dude, there's there's so freaking much going on right now. It's not even 11 yet. What the hell? Like, there's so much. It's not even 11. We've already gotten 6 out of 2. It should be 7 out of 2 soon, unless that gun is... Yeah, 7 out of 2. Dude, like, why can't every game be like this? Okay, we're gonna do a quick. We're getting a phone call? Um, code is. 82649. 8, 82649. 8, On that ringing phone, I don't know if it's something you can answer or if it's just. It's probably just one of the sound effects. And nothing. Okay. We're good. And we can sit back down. Uh, quickly check here. Doing good, good, good. 7 out of 2. It's almost 11. Okay, good. Being successful. Checking all the things. Okay. Doing very good. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. Like, 7 out of 2. We're not even at 11 yet. The only thing that can ruin this is gonna be the female noir because she's an asshole and she kills me every time so she is the only thing that can ruin this for me because we're already done everything we need for basically this entire hour everything we're gonna be working towards is gonna be forbidden night and um that's a wallet, I think, right there. I think that's a wallet. So that'll be high value. We'll send. And then we're gonna get up. Mother! Go die! Jesus. I I hate when they are right behind me like that. Like, I can handle if he's in my bathroom or if he's in my bedroom. Not right behind me when I turn around in my fucking chair. Jesus. What? Okay, awesome. So, we got that one right. Good. It was a good guess, though. It was a good thing I backed out right then, because... You, nothing worse than him grabbing me when we're doing so well. Um, do we... We don't have a package yet. So, just keep looking. Uh, hopefully Mr. DelFalco does not show up, because... I honestly don't want to deal with him yet. He has not really shown up. I just know that he can because we're not playing casual. Um, <laughs> still, we're doing good. Not a lot of changes, not a lot of anything added. Uh, maybe we'll see the lady who was crying. Because we saw her here and then we saw her here. So my guess is that those three rooms have to be interconnected. It would make sense. They're all like house rooms. Uh, but it would make sense. Okay, we're, we're doing good. We're doing great. The only thing that will ruin it is if I have to go up to the roof and run into the lady I do not want to see. I, I don't. Dude, every time I go to click to leave, suspicious send. Stand up, look around. Not there. And we don't have anyone here. Yeah, and then in the um other video yesterday was when I had all the lights off. There's at one point when I stood up and the guy was right here, but we didn't see it because I stood up. Jesus! Fucking Dude, it was such a good round, and then fucking Lucas has to come and ruin that shit. I am 
so annoyed. That was such a good round. Jesus Christ. I hate... Dude, it was so good. We were doing so well. We were so far ahead. And then it just... Just because Lucas had to show up as I had my flashlight on. Which triggers him. That or because I ran. But... Dude, ruined my whole life. Um, okay, we'll do one more. We'll do one more because I want to make it past midnight. I do want to make it past midnight. Because, unfortunately, we don't really have any other options. Okay. Um. We'll do... One more. Probably cry this time if I die. <laughs> like, I was complaining earlier about how Lucas was not a thing anymore. I barely saw him. And then his ass shows up when I'm having such a good game. I was having so much fun. Like, so much fun. And he shows up. And he ruins my life. Like, I, it was 100% my mistake. I don't think I'm supposed to run. And I know I'm not supposed to have my flashlight on. But he literally showed up just as I was going back to my chair. It was so unfair. Um. Gotta look for it. Oh, there's a flashlight. Okay. We go turn this light off. Like, I've been. I was so prepared for him this whole time. I've been so prepared. Okay, so we're... No, thank you. Uh, 12, 5, 9, 5 at 10 p.m. We're going to try and track to see how long it takes for it to turn off. And we'll start looking through everything. But I don't know if it's going to match up to last round, and that's really, really sad for me. It's so sad. We were doing so good. I had so we had high hopes we were having a great time and then but look Lu still isn't even the biggest problem like he's still not even the biggest problem and that's the annoying thing but oh well um let's see see if we can find anything um at all let's see nope 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 Nope, 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 nope. Come on, game. Just, just give me some stuff, you know? Give me a good round. Give me... Till 5 a.m. would be nice. I would like to beat it. I would enjoy... Having to beat this, but... I made some poor choices on probably the, the best round we had. Like, it was... Like, we were so, we had seven, like, we were so set up for midnight, and then Lucas had to show up out of nowhere. That was the worst thing. And that was after spending how many rounds we played where he never showed his face once. Like, we were in there so much, and the biggest issue we had was the female noir. Lucas? Nowhere. He was nowhere to be seen, he didn't say a single thing. And then, the one time he kills me this this time and it was on the best game we were having like so much stuff was happening but oh well let's hope that this game has this round has as many um little interactions as the other one um maybe mr del falco but again i don't know when he shows up or how he gets triggered so we're just gonna keep trying. I'm not really worried about um, the Noir or Lucas until after I get messages from Clint. So we just gotta hope, hope, hope that things happen. Okay. You did not sit on the cat. I'm gonna take the cat away from you. She's fine. No. We've been over this. You need to check your chair before you sit down. You. Okay. 
so we're back sorry about that my fiance almost sat on our cat and we are now gonna hopefully find some ev some th something any change anything because it's Why'd they get a guinea pig? Oh, know. we have cash right there. They said it was free. Okay. Um, oof. Here's the thing. This stuff is gonna be very irritating and very slow right now. I said most matches and rounds, they just take forever for anything to happen. It's so irritating. Okay, well, we have one out of two. Um, we have messages from Adam, so we just gotta wait for Clint's messages, and then they should, um... It should start having the Noir and all of them active and such. Oh, um... Can you go preheat the oven? What? Can you go preheat the oven? Um, what? Um, do you have that... It's for the chicken your mom sent me the recipe for. I don't know. You should still have a message. Please and thank you. Okay. And still nothing. Absolutely nothing. Like, I think the most boring part... Oh, we got a wallet right there. I think the most boring part about this game is just, um... How slowly things happen. Like, I know, like, observation duty and stuff like that, that... If you've played it, it's like this where you just like, you know, find, like, spot the difference or changes. But that, it's like, things happen, but it's always just small changes. Like, things missing, something added, something moved. But it's all just smaller changes. And more about memorizing a room. Like this adds the whole, you know, welcome to the game factor of you're being hunted while you're doing this. But it's just... The interactions and stuff are just so far in between. But you also don't want to make a game that's an exact copy or the exact same as another one. That's just copying. That's that's not fair. Also, you shouldn't really be proud if you just uh, copy and paste a game without really any change, other than like small changes. But it happens. One game gets successful and then everyone wants to have that same kind of success. That's what happened when um, Phasmophobia got really popular. So after Phasmophobia really took off, it was just ghost hunting games on ghost hunting ghost. games on ghost hunting games. Like, there's some really good, there's some good ones that took Phasmo and did better, or took Phasmo and just added and it ended up pretty well but it'd still be nice to have ghost hunting without it all being phasma style but again can't go wrong when a company did so well um thank you for all your information clint it's appreciated I'm not really seeing a whole oh keys keys they're um high value i believe And while it looks, we get up, and we wander, and we check. Like, why is... The art in games make no sense why they choose it. I know it's just clutter and stuff, but, like, it makes no sense. Like, would you have that picture just randomly sitting in your living room? Um, we are already at 1028, and this has not changed yet, so... Let's... Let's keep an eye. So I really want to have a correlation between, like, the game time and the time that this will change. I think it'll really... Oh! 17766. So, like, right before... So, like... 29 minutes in game time, it seems. I'd say like 10 or so minutes for us. Seven, 
15. I don't think this is right. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Dude. That happens when I don't pay. Uh, 17766. Six. Okay, 17766. Six. 17766. Six. You got one seven seven six six enter nice um quick check in the bathroom are you in nope oh, we're, we're good and we can sit down i assume we're gonna have a package waiting for us when we come back on or not fair enough you do you mr shade make your choices no one's gonna stop you. I'm not seeing much of anything. Uh, I said always feel free to point out if you do see anything or you notice anything. Oh, we got a phone right there, so that's a hack. That'll get us to number four. Check for... nope. Okay. Uh, let's see. Hmm... Nada. Nada. We're also gonna check the windows now that we know that um that peeping Tom dude can just randomly be at a window. I don't know if it's just that window or other windows as well. But there's like a lot of them in the game. So we're definitely gonna have to keep our eye out for that. Cause I didn't realize things could happen outside of the room. Nope. Okay, nothing, uh, message, nothing about a, so nothing about it having a package, which sucks. Cause that one is just a free way to get this, even though it's more risky cause you actually have to leave your room. But let's do this. Nine C. We have a package for nine C that we need to go get. We have a package for nine C. Go get said package for nine C. And then we're gonna take the package to nine C. And I think I've said it enough that I will remember it. Let's hope. Let's hope, 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 hope. We go to the rooftop. Close very slowly and then very slowly go up. Let's wait and party and rock out to the lovely elevator music. Do do do. Do 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 do. Um, and yes, now we know that Lucas shoots, I think, from that building. But I think it'd be really cool if they had added, like, maybe a silhouette or something. Because I don't know what it looks like when he's aiming from that building. But if they added, like, a silhouette so, like, you could see him and kind of have a little heads up. That would have been cool. But I don't think they did. I think it's just a random laser pointer light that we can see. Who knows, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is just like, hey, here's this game, and eventually they're gonna come up with an actual Welcome to the Game 3, but that, they have to like set up actual websites and all that, and I feel like that probably takes some time. I don't produce games, so I'm not sure. There's your package, I'm going to my room. I think it was one seven seven and two six. Wicked. So smart. Oh. No, okay. Ah, uh, we're good. And we sit back down in our chair. My guy, you, you gotta stop breathing like that. It is very irritating. Like I get you don't want to run, but I don't want to walk slowly. I just do not want to do that. I don't want to be slow. I want to get from point A to point B as fast as I can. Oh, there's... 
There's a gun right there. I don't know if you see it. But like, right on that suitcase. Don't know if that's happened before and I've just missed it. But now that we do that, we do our perimeter check. Nothing there. Probably a dumb idea to just look out the window like that, though. But I don't know if, like, he actually gives you a chance to get away if he, like, does it. I just know no flashlight and no running now. Mm, nothing. Look at that, we're 6 out of 2, so pretty good. Again, before 11, so I think we got lucky again. We have enough to get us through the entire next hour. Check for the red light. Nothing. Awesome. Uh, that still hasn't changed. We should be getting it, like, at 10.59. That's when I want to say it's going to change. When I want to say it's going to change. I know it was nothing. I know the sound was nothing, but can't I can't not check. We're good. Okay. Do, sit down at your chair. Don't walk past it. Um, so let me double check. I didn't really get a good look over it. Okay. No. So far, the only thing that happened in this room I've seen is like that foot that we saw earlier. Other than that, I haven't seen like anything. I've seen like a bag or a package there. I don't really think I've seen anything here. Um, those can open. Uh, package is right there. I always find things just as I'm pressing X. Um, high value, right there. And then we're gonna check, 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 you check, check, check. Still nothing, no, nada, nothing. I should probably back up and check for my stuff. Uh, no, not in the bathroom. I don't know if, like, closing the door would actually help. Because I feel like closing it just means I won't be able to see if he does spawn there. But I don't know if I close in, it just means that he won't spawn there. Mm, so my guess was wrong. It's now 11 and that hasn't changed. So... I guess I was wrong about the time, which sucks. Maybe you can't actually just uh, time it. I could see being a thing, not actually letting you time how often you have to check and actually have to pay attention instead. Um, we don't have any packages, but it seems so far it seems we get like one package an hour is what I've been gathering from our playing. It's like one package every hour, so I don't know how you could get the miss three packages thing. That must be later game he gets you to do more. Because um, we haven't really made it super late in the game, so it just means it's probably one of those things that after 12 you probably get more deliveries and then we're going to have to leave the apartment more. That's the only way I can justify the fact that they need, like, if, uh, you can only miss three packages, is they give you more later on. Okay, I get it. You were probably coming from upstairs, but, like, you can't not check. Also can't have the flashlight on because that pisses Lucas off. I really only need it so I can see into the bathroom. That's the only room I currently have the light off in. Because the other ones stay on and I can turn them off as I leave to hide from Lucas. Even though every time I've been killed by Lucas it's been <laughs> unfortunately a dumb mistake and I don't get to hide. But that's okay. Okay, nothing yet. Still nothing in the rooms. Still nothing changing. Mm. For a second, it, I thought the door was open. Um, nothing. Oh! It 
changed. Uh, we have 98668. 98668. 98668. I'm curious if, um, 98668. What? Is that not it? I'm curious if Lucas can kill you when you're inputting the code. Nine zero six six eight, maybe nine zero six six eight. Let's see, uh, nine oh six six eight. Okay, I just mixed up the um, zero for an eight. It happens. Yeah, I get it. You can't run at all. I get it. You don't gotta breathe so loudly. Oh, broken camera, my favorite. Definitely always love when the camera breaks. Let's see. Okay. Not oh, wrong way. Wait. We got it. Damn it. Uh, I think that is our package that we need to go grab. Uh, 7A. Okay, we'll go get package for 7A. Just make sure you're not there, because I feel like if they're there when I leave the room, um, they might just end up killing me. But you can't really, you don't really seem to be able to run away from the noir. Like, we did learn that you can run away from, um, Lucas when he's up, you know, if we're on the roof, we can go to the elevator and get away from him. But the Noir, I don't think you can run away from them. I think you actually have to face them head on, which sucks. But, I mean, the male guy, the male's easy. It's just the female and figuring out how close you can actually get before she, uh, decides to attack you. But we gotta go here and then we go to 7... A motherfucker. <sighs> okay, this is probably gonna end poorly. I don't. Here's, I don't know how close this to Come closer. Damn it! <laughs> Every time. Oh no, the noir are scarier. I don't think I've survived against them. Um, the female one yet. Like, I don't get how close I'm supposed to get to her is the problem, I think, which sucks, but it just makes me want to cry sometimes. You gotta get, you can only get so close. Um, but, so you kind of joined quite late. Uh, we are just about to end now. I do need to go and make dinner unfortunately being an adult kind of sucks so i do want to thank everyone who tuned in for the um 